Peter Moran. Tug Peter Moran, come in. Tug Peter Moran, Captain Phil speaking. Ready to pick up the Queen Mary, Captain? Yep. Captain Jones is just coming down the ladder from the Elena. <laughs> The Elena is saying goodbye to us now. Better get on down to the Queen Mary. Captain Jones is the docking pilot. Over. Roger. Hello. Say, Phil, I see we have company today. Yes, Captain Jones meets Dave and Judy. Hello. <laughs> it's a pleasure. Queen's downriver, Captain Jones. You mean we're really going to dock the Queen Mary, Captain Jones? Why, that's the biggest ship in the world, isn't it? Big enough. Five city blocks long and 14 stories high. You youngsters are lucky to be along this time. I guess you'll really see something. Is this tug going to bring that big ship in all along, Captain? No, there'll be others there, too, but Captain Jones... Mm. Tug Peter Moran, Captain Phil speaking. Ready to pick up the Queen Mary, Captain? Yep. Captain Jones is just coming down the ladder from the Elena. Elena is saying goodbye to us now. Better get on down to the Queen Mary. Captain Jones is the docking pilot. Over. Roger. Hello. Say, Phil, I see we have company today. Yes, Captain Jones meets Dave and Judy. Hello. <laughs> it's a pleasure. Queen's downriver, Captain Jones. You mean we're really going to dock the Queen Mary, Captain Jones? Why, that's the biggest ship in the world, isn't it? Big enough. Five city blocks long and 14 stories high. You youngsters are lucky to be along this time. I guess you'll really see something. Is this tug going to bring that big ship in all along, Captain? No, there'll be others there, too, but Captain Jones here will be in charge. Way up on the bridge of the Queen Mary. There she is now, Captain Phil, that great big black ship with the red and black smokestacks and one, two, three, four tugs alongside her. Is she signaling to us, Captain Phil? No, she's just telling that tug with the railroad barges over there she'll pass upriver on his port side. Hear that? Now that's the tug answering. A ship always answers by repeating the signal, so there's no chance of a mix-up. Look out, Captain Phil. We're getting too close to the Queen Mary. She's right over us. Oh, don't worry about that. We've got to go alongside so I can get on board. Well, so long. See you later. You see? The Queen knows we're here. Look, they're opening a hatch in the side of the Queen. And there's Captain Jones climbing up a ladder from our deck to get in through it. Now, if you watch, you'll see him in a few minutes away up there on the bridge. Say, there he is now. That whistle is his signal. That's it. We're all ready to go to work now. We just parade upriver alongside till we're opposite her pier. Then we help turn her. Is that the bell 
to the engine room, Captain Phil? No, nope, that's the ship bell. Tells time. It's 1.30. How many men are in the crew, Captain Phil? There's seven of us. The captain, mate, two deckhands, then the chief in the engine room, and the oiler, and the cook. And do the men eat here and sleep on board, too? Oh, sure. We got bunks on board. You see, the crew works two days on and two days off. And when we go off, another crew comes on board. <laughs> The queen's going to turn now. See, we're on the bow here, pushing right up against her. And another tug's on her starboard side. Other tugs with the hawsers, there the ropes you see, are pulling upriver on her stern. That's all there is to it. We push, they pull. In that way, we swing her around. <whistles> Captain Jones wants all the power we've got. Got to ease up now. Don't want to turn her too far around. That's the tug on the starboard bow. We'll pull away now, and the other tug will push against her bow upriver and hold her in line with the pier. Slower down. Dead slow ahead it is. Chief nosing in along the pier now. See, those tugs on the stern have swung behind and are pulling back on her. Well, a ship as heavy as this keeps right on moving forward through the water. Those tugs on the stern are acting as brakes now. They're dropping ropes down to the pier from the deck of the Queen. The men on the pier are looping them around those posts. Hawsers, not ropes, we call them. And those posts are the bollards. They'll warp her in and tie her up now. <whistles> yep, and that means our job is about done. Tug Peter Moran. Come in, Tug Peter Moran. Tug Peter Moran, Captain Phil speaking. The Coronado is down at Pier 3. Captain Smith is on board. You'll take her out by yourself. Roger. Roger. 